Today we have 300 young uh, European leaders uh, in the Rijks Museum, and as Axel Nobel we are hosting a dinner for them, and uh, I give a small talk, and there is a journalist who gives a small talk. The world that my generation has created, I apologize for that publicly, is unsustainable. I, or you, do not elect. My euro depends on what Silvio Berlusconi does in Italy. You are the new leaders of this world. The division of Europe in East and West. The more you serve, the more effective you will be as a leader. So, welcome and have a nice evening. I really liked the first speech because it, it was very encouraging for uh, young people such as myself to be leaders. He really uh, showed uh, how important the future is for us. The main message is that we need change. You don't get change if you don't change the culture behind it. And you don't get culture change if there's no leadership change. So we need leaders that are willing to serve the world. The problem we're dealing with in this session is ending the crisis. Especially the second um, speaker, he addressed the crisis that the European Union is in at the moment. I think it's really inspirational just for the students to see where they will go in the future and that they actually can change something. We're sponsoring the European Youth Parliament as part of our employer value proposition activities. You know, we really want to position ourselves as an employer of choice in our key markets and that means getting out there and talking to the types of talent that Axe Nobel wants to attract. It's a really great way of connecting with key talent and we do so not in a way that we just send messages but we get out there and we discuss key issues such as leadership, sustainability, all things that are going to be issues for Europe and the world today and tomorrow. It's important that we help young leaders to understand the challenges of this world and that we support them in solving these challenges in the world.